NVIDIA GeForce 20, 30 and 40 series graphics cards use RTX technology, a graphics rendering method that simulates the natural behavior of light. NVIDIA made real-time ray tracing possibility with NVIDIA RTX series. The first real-time coherent ray tracing GPU later became a pioneer of this technology. In 2018, NVIDIA launched GeForce 20, the first series of consumer graphics cards to introduce RTX technology. GeForce RTX graphics cards are based on the Turing GPU architecture and the RTX platform, offering up to six times the performance of the previous generation of graphic cards. Also, the cards are manufactured on an optimized 14NM node from TSMC, called 12NM FinFET NVIDIA and comes with GDDR6 memory chips from the Micron technology respectively Samsung Electronics. The 2000 series of graphic cards include the RTX 2060, 2070, 2080 and 2080 Ti and Titan RTX models. In 2019, NVIDIA launched GeForce RTX 20 series supermodels that increase performance by up to 25%. Supermodels come with the same architecture, Turing, the same manufacturing technology, 12NM, FinFET, and the same basic core, TU-104 and TU-106. NVIDIA playing a little with the number of processing units, respectively the amount of memory. Regarding the design, the differences compared to the previous versions are minimal, this time the black median area being replaced by a metal insert on which the name of the product is written. In 2020, NVIDIA launched the next generation of graphic cards, the GeForce RTX 30. This series is based on an Ampere architecture, the second generation of RTX architecture from NVIDIA with new RT cores tensor cores and streaming multiprocessors and cutting-edge AI features generation. This series includes the NVIDIA RTX 3050, RTX 3060, RTX 3070, RTX 3080 and RTX 3090 models. All RTX 3000 series GPUs are manufactured using Samsung's custom 8NM process node and features new NVIDIA shader cores, second-generation ray tracing cores and third-generation tensor cores. NVIDIA needed an improved cooling design, so they opted for a dual-fan design, but instead of both fans placed at the bottom, NVIDIA put one fan at the top end. The fan directs air upwards towards the CPU cooler on top of the case. NVIDIA expands the RTX 30 series and launches the GeForce RTX 3060 Ti, 3070 Ti, 3080 Ti and 3090 Ti. A new era of RTX neural rendering has started. Today, we're announcing Ada Lovelace, our third generation RTX. In 2022, NVIDIA introduced a new generation of graphic cards, the GeForce RTX 40 series. The new series comes with an 8102 graphics chip and uses TSMC's N4 manufacturing process, which offers up to 76 billion transistors, more and more than double the previous generation. Also, the third generation of the RTX family comes with a new architecture, Ada Lovelace, which promises improved efficiency and more than twice the performance compared to the previous Ampere architecture. RTX 4000 brings new technologies such as DLSS3, NVIDIA RTX Remix, shader execution re-recording, but also a significant improvement of the technologies already existing in the RTX family. The new models of graphics card in the 4000 series are the RTX 4090 and the two variants of the RTX 4080 of 16 and 12 GB respectively. The construction of the 4000 series is similar to the previous generation, PCB of an atypical size and a cooling system on top made of aluminum blades along the entire length of the board. In the connector area, we have a fan mounted on the back of the video card, which draws cold air through the radiator and evacuates it upwards.